back to Old Guy Firewood. Come along for some sights and sounds from the 2024 Paul Bunyan Show in Cambridge, Ohio. Hope you enjoy. Checking out some of the logs here at the Paul Bunyan Show. I've got a few big pieces of wood here. Patrick in there for reference. He's a little under six foot, so you can get an idea. That's a big chunk of wood. You want to get high up in a tree, take some branches off. Too high for me. Chainsaws. Drill tools. Wood heaters. It's all here. Wolfridge has a large presence here at the show this year. I think they've got actually two two spots here taken up. Got their new uh, 17 BS C with the conveyor. Without the C, it's without the conveyor. That's been a real hit. What is There's a 17 VS up here without the conveyor. right there okay i'm here at the bunyan show with uh ted and sherry miller in in front of the sc14 dyna which is a machine that they own uh and uh we're just talking about that you like your dyna we have a 2011 sc14 dyna and it's the, the dyna guys have come a long way since since you know what 13 years or yeah. however a lot of uh, upgrades yeah a lot of upgrades a lot of, it's nice. It's a very nice unit. We are very seriously considering doing a little trading with them. Not today. Got a couple of things to pay off. You know how that goes. Yeah, yeah. So we're seriously considering one of these in the future. Yeah. She's Probably retired. The next couple of yeah, years. She's retired. I'm about four years away. So we're seriously considering moving up, making this our full-time job, yeah. along with our stumps. And like I've told everybody before, Dick, you know this, uh, my stump grinding fuels my firewood addiction right and that's what we got to the addiction yeah. she's been in the business long before i come around fourth generation on our land and wood yard that we that we have we're very fortunate for the equipment we got very fortunate for guys like old guy firewood Ethan, and rachel over here hard working man all you guys have, have welcomed us into your community and we are just honored to be part of it. Well, we, uh, we help a, each other out, and it's an amazing community. It, it's a great community, a great bunch of people. We all learn from each other. Yep. And uh, folks watching, if, if you haven't gone to their channel, you need to check them out. It's uh, Miller's. Get it right. Miller's, Miller's Stumps, Stumps and Firewood. And Firewood. We're located Miller's, in Southern Illinois. So, yeah, we really appreciate it, Dick. Thank you for giving us a Miller's, shout. Uh, Miller's Stumps and Firewood. Check it out. Great channel. And uh, thanks so much for talking with me. Hey, thank it. you, sir. Hey, no problem. We appreciate Enjoy it. Enjoy the show. Excavators all size, shape, and manufacture. The big machine right there. Having a contest to guess how many board feet are in the logs on this trailer. What do you think? All kind of food options here. Got some wood-fired pizza. And who do we run into here? Ken and Dan. Almost ran into Woo! us because you weren't almost looking. Almost ran into them, yeah. How you guys doing? We're doing awesome. Just got here. Hey, how are you? Oh, Got to get myself a new, new hat. You guys enjoying the show? So far. Yeah. Just got here. A lot of good new stuff here. Is it really? Pretty, yeah. Yeah. You never good. know who you're gonna run into here. What's up, Don? How's it going, man? Good. Yeah. Good. You didn't get hammered last night. <laughs> we'll uh, we'll work on it tonight. We'll wait, wait for tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Here we are at Frickin' Jeeps. Frickin' Jeeps. 
meet and greet. There's the man himself right there. How you doing there? Hey, John, how's it going? Perfect. Hanging on a Christmas tree. Thank you. Yes. So, uh, listen, I, Sarah went and hid. She must, oh, not like, she? she must not like the camera. No, she's a little bit camera shy, but she ends up being on a, on a few of them. Yeah. Do you know how to spell your name? Uh, I've got one. I, I've got one that you've you done for me one. before. Uh, let me tell you, you you know you're not dressed properly for the Bunyan show. Why is that? Ah. That belongs on your shirt. Okay, well, I will put it on there in just now, a minute. i got to thank you in the Woodhound department because you're older than me, so I ain't the oldest goat geezer here. That's right. I think I am I, the I, oldest woodhound here. I appreciate you more than you can imagine. I've got you by, uh, what, two, maybe three years. Two years. I'll, three. Be, I'll be 73 in three weeks. Okay. Well, I'm but 75, so two years now, and in January, I'll have you by three. That's good. So, I hope yeah. you have me, get me... I keep. I hope you keep going. Is what I'm trying to yeah, say. Yeah, I hope but we it, continue to have that uh, gap between. Yeah, us, yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, you're yeah. smarter than me. Come on up here. We, do you have a tag? Did you get a name? I'm tag? gonna go ahead and sign this saw blade. Saw the little corner pieces that we cut on and make our benches out of. We've used them on our own shop in our own building uh, as corner caps. We're here at the Easton Made booth with Andrew Easton. How's it going, Dick? Doing great, Andrew. I tell you, you got a great, uh, great setup here this year. Uh, yeah, we've got quite a few machines. We've we've had some pretty, pretty great help here all weekend. We we've had a lot of the YouTube guys at the booth here helping out, and it's been so much appreciated. We've had their support, and that, that we've been able to. To, to show off the machine so well and, and answer people's questions. So. That's great. You've got got a few new things this year. Yeah, we do. Yeah, this yeah. We, you we want to tell us about those. Well, we've got we've got the new bundler here. That's the Wrap Master. Uh -huh. It uh, you can wrap a half cubic foot bundle, three quarters, or one cubic foot bundle. The cool thing about it is uh, it'll always index in the exact same spot, and uh, you can set it. It's very easy to control how many wraps you have on it. So that, that that's been a pretty cool setup. And then. It's all direct drive too, so it's ah, it's uh, there's no belch or pulley or anything like that, and there's really no maintenance on it. All right, all right. So the uh, the axle, so to speak, is mounted right on the motor. Yeah, that's exactly yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. And then we've tried we've tried to make it so it's a fairly easy piece to move around, and then mm -hmm. and then the work area is it's pretty well wide open, so you can reach in, grab a bundle, and it's not like you're kicking any any extra stands or anything like that, that are in your way. So. Right. Neat, neat. And you've got your. Uh, Upgraded axis out here this year. Yeah, yeah, we we have the 23 horse axis. That's probably going to be the standard axis uh, from here on out. You'll likely see the price of that go up in the next month or so uh -huh. uh, to accommodate that. But it uh, it's been pretty well received, and we've got a lot of really great feedback on it. it. It's amazing to watch it run. Uh, it's fast. Uh, or you can idle it down, and I guess you get pretty much the same pressure, and, and it slows oh, yeah, down. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you can idle, you can idle it down quite a bit. And the nice thing about that is that when you do idle it down, you're kind of in the the, the perfect torque curve of the engine when you do that, and uh, it's not near as noisy to run. Like it, right. It's, yeah. it, it's and, and the performance of it, even at that, is still still quicker than most people want to work, and, anyways. And so. a little bit uh, less of the gas guzzler. That's exactly it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah that's yeah. exactly it. Yeah. Well, great to see you out here, Andrew, and. Uh, uh, Always look forward to this show. This is my go-to. We we, all, we always have a blast with this one. This, this one this one's one of the finest ones of the year for yeah, us. So. Yeah. Well, thanks so much for your time. Well, thanks for having me, Dick. Here at the Easton Made booth, gathering spot of celebrities. Addie. Oh, you know what? I'm Karen. Hi. Bill. All the celebrities are here. Where's the furnace? Never tried to sell me. Brand. Where the pros gather. I've got a gathering of pros here. I thought I'd take advantage. Get some shots. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Woo!
another celebrity trying to give an excuse for why he came late. <laughs> and we know the true reason. We were it's, with it's him last night. normally Rachel, but we got some time. End, end of January, you know. Okay. I work fast. The celebrities, work fast. The celebrities What's continue up, guys? to appear. <laughs> yeah. Jake, Chris and Jake. Oh, yeah. How's it going? In feed log, in feed out. And then this is a wedge adjustment, and that is your in-feed in terms of a log. And, and just... Try to climb that. All right, let's all give him a round of applause. Great job, Briar. stump grinders. It's their entry level 40 wheel model. Track model. The big boy there, diesel. We got some big chippers here too. of sawmills out here. Baker. Baker's a big name. And large commercial sawmills. Pretty much fully automated. How about this for back and wood? Processors. 
really nice clean wood. I'm hoping at this cleaner. There's a tipper for you. If you don't have a tractor and you got a PTO driven splitter like this uh, Yappa, there's the power plant for it. Hook it up to your PTO. Right, is pretty much known for their PVs and uh, can hooks and hookaroons or pickaroons. They also make some really neat iron legs that you can use with uh, with slabs to make tables. They've got a picnic bench there, picnic table and bench. Got one here. Pretty neat. Wolfridge has a complete lineup of their sawmills here the hobby mills right here there's the lx50 super that's the one i have and uh, one that just came out with here the lx50 stark which is similar to the super only it's got a smaller engine bandit chipper i think that thing would take about a 36 inch tree alverson Robin and Larry sure like theirs on their Bobcat. And Phil Anderson, I believe, uses a Halverson also. Dyna Firewood Processors. Dyna SC16. If you watch Heath and Rachel at Hardworking Man, you've seen them running this machine. Parker Implements. Multi-tech. Lucas Mill, swing mill. Man, look at that slab. That's got to be every bit of uh, 30 inches, 36 inches. Huge, huge logging machines from Tiger Cat.